Hello and welcome back to another Medrivisions video. Today we'll be discussing a May 2022 recall and also give you some helpful tips for the upcoming exams. And hopefully that will bring you one step closer to passing the PLEB 1 exam. Let's dive right into the video. Now before we discuss the question, please take 50 seconds to pause the video and comment the answer down below. We have a 70-year-old woman with a history of adenocarcinoma and lung commutation who presents to the hospital for a review. Her pulse is 85, blood pressure is 110 over 70 and temperature is 37.3. On examination, she has halitosis. What is the initial treatment for her halitosis? So the correct answer is antiseptic mouthwash. Now before we discuss the other options and um, why this is the correct answer, don't forget to smash that like button and also comment down below on um, what you're waiting to hear from us next, which topics you'd like us to cover and also make sure to check out the reviews from our past PLAB1 candidates. The link is in the description below. So we have some exciting news for you. Go check out our new update where we have our new study notes which you can study before you attempt the questions. And we also have our revision notes, which is the added new feature where you get the highlighted parts and the key points to make it easier to do your revision. And the other thing is, once you are done with the notes, you can attempt those particular questions that come under those notes separately, any section you like. So do check it out. Why is this antiseptic uh, mouthwash? Now, this patient has uh, likely undergone uh, chemotherapy or radiotherapy due to the adenocarcinoma. Oral mucositis is a side effect which can present uh, with dryness, halitosis, pain, inflammation and oral mucosa ulceration. Alright, so oral hygiene, good hydration and avoiding alcohol and tobacco may help the person's comfort and also antibiotics may be needed to treat the infectious complications and therefore antiseptic mouthwash is the best option out of the given choices to treat a halitosis. Okay, so let's discuss the other options. Why not low-level laser therapy? Low-level laser therapy treats or prevents oral mucositis by promoting in and promoting healing, reducing inflammation and increasing a cell metabolism. Now, this can be done with chemotherapy or radiotherapy or even prior to the interventions. But as a patient is not experiencing severe signs of OM or oral mucositis, the best initial step will not be low-level laser therapy, isn't it? So what about oral propranolol? This is a beta blocker and this is not necessary in this case. And oral steroids, steroids can cause candidiasis and is not an appropriate option. Lastly, no treatment is needed. Well, it's blatantly the wrong answer. Halitosis should be treated and doing nothing can worsen this condition. Okay, I hope that question was clear to everyone. Antiseptic mouthwash is the correct answer. Hop on over to our med revisions platform for more questions like this, uh, high yield as well as some rare topics uh, that you might encounter in the exams.